You write your own cases, you control the message, you control the learning objectives, the industry, the topic, you control everything. And you can write exactly what you want your students to learn and what will best serve the needs of your classes. Cases are everywhere. You're out driving on your way to work and you see a store has gone out of business. Why? A colleague tells you about something that's happening in his or her personal life. It's interesting. You read a newspaper article about something that's important in the world, a company that's doing major transformations. What's that about? A student brings uh, a story to you in class about a problem that he's dealing with within his own division. These are all cases in the making, just waiting for you to follow up on them. It's really important to adapt your cases to the level of students that you're working with. If a case is too, uh, too complex for undergraduates, they won't prepare properly, you'll end up with a weak discussion and very little learning will result. The same happens if a case is too simple for graduate students. They're just not going to prepare, they're going to be bored, and you won't have any really good learning. So the key to a good case discussion is calibration of the discussion questions to the level of the student. You can make them more complex for graduate students and uh, less sophisticated for undergraduate students.